was uh, honestly a really, really tough match. Like 4-3 at the end, Elsa taking the clinch. I mean, it was amazing. Like I couldn't have dreamed better, honestly. Like it was, I'm, I'm honestly speechless. Like I have no words to describe the feeling. It's amazing. You had a huge week Thursday with the match clincher and yeah. a huge comeback in second set. Yeah. Today, another win. What does it feel like to end your Tarleton home career with a couple of wins? I mean, it means a lot. Honestly, it means a lot. Like winning here twice this weekend on senior day, I mean, it's amazing. Like, honestly, if I would have lost, uh, yeah, no, I cannot imagine that, but yeah, it feels so good, it feels so good. I have no words, honestly, to describe it, as I said, but honestly, amazing journey. Like, four years here is a lot, but it didn't feel like four years, honestly. It, feel, it felt like one, <laughs> not, not kidding. And like, maybe my best year was, yeah, for sure last year. I mean, we were world champions, so for sure the best year. And yeah, I went 20 and one in singles, so yeah, I, I couldn't have dreamed better. What has been your favorite moment in your Charleston career? Favorite moment? Uh, I would say senior day last year. <clears throat> I was uh, playing doubles with uh, Faustine who was uh, my, best friend, my best friend here, so it meant a lot. And uh, yeah, we won the boss points, we clinched with her, and then I won the, um, the, the last match. We were up 6-0, and then I won the last match, so it was like 7-0. And it was a really, really tough match, and uh, yeah, it was the best feeling I've ever had, and we were like what, ch what champion this, uh, this day, so that was, yeah, the best day for me. Uh, what's next for you? Next for me, I'm gonna go back to France because I really did it, <laughs> honestly. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna do my master in France and uh, yeah, maybe work at the same time. I don't know yet, but yeah, I'm going back to France for sure. You gonna be, are you gonna go play tennis while you're in France or is this? Uh, yeah, I don't want to stop playing. <laughs> It's not going to be like college tennis, but I still want to play like tournament in France. I don't know, like play for fun, maybe. But I, I won't stop. I won't stop for sure. Celia's career has been really impressive. I mean, she um, is the last player from the D2 uh, era, and uh, she just stepped up on so many levels, uh, both on the court, uh, in the classroom, with the team, as a leader. Uh, just uh, an impressive uh, four years, and, and last year she's one of the main reasons why we won uh, a championship. So uh, we hope to repeat again this year, and uh, I'm excited to see uh, the next few weeks how they go. I want to say uh, thank you to the coaches, obviously, to my teammates uh, who support me the, the whole four years to my family, my friends, I mean, everyone who cheered for us, the fans, like, honestly, everyone, and just like, thank you so much, and bleed purple, <laughs> sorry, my voice, I lost it, but bleed purple for life, of course, and uh, let's go Texans. <laughs>